the Betfred listed chase is next up. This is three miles and one furlong. It's a listed race over the Mildmay course and Master of Shadows at the top for Joshua Sutherland. Ruby Gallup, Daniel French, Blood Eagle, Leon Van Rensburg, Bronwyn Killing, David Robertson, Catherine the Great, Paul Rhodes, Club Card, David Healy, Jane Bird and Martin Lidham, Lintz, Darren Thompson and What No Son, Paul Craig Beckwith. So a field of nine. This one. Called in and ready to go and off they go. Jane Bird will closest to us. Just the first to show with Master of Shadows on the inside. It looks like Master of Shadows is going to lead into the first. And then all safely over that first fence with Master of Shadows settling down into the lead. Jane Bird in second and Lynch third. The one that's just a couple of lengths adrift from the rest of them is Bronwyn Killing at the back. But a long way to go yet. And the pace is pretty sedate as they get to the second. Once they're all safely over with, Bron with Master of Shadows. Just in the lead then from Jane Burden in second, the grey rider on the far side is Ruby Gallop. First in through now, What No Sun has moved into second. The one closest to us is Catherine the Great and the red and the yellow. As they get to the next, well, they're all safely over that one. The horse is still manoeuvring for position, trying to figure out where they want to be as they pass the Grand National Wall to jump past the winning post. And they'll now swing out left handed on the first of two circuits that they want to complete still. And Master of Shadows is three lengths clear of Catherine the Great, who's in second. And Bronwyn Killen, who's moved through now into third, from being last early on. Club Card on the outside is fourth. Then What No Sun. And on the inside of What No Sun, Jane Burden. And then Blood Eagle and Lintz. And finally, the only grey in the field, Ruby Gallop, is the back marker. Racing down towards the next step. It's Master of Shadows with a clear lead. And about four or five lengths to Catherine the Great in second. Club Card is third, Bronwyn Killen is fourth. Then Jane Bird and what no son, and then Lintz as they get over the next. Oh, a real mistake there by the David Hooley horse Club Card. Really took a dive at it, but got away with it. And Master of Shadows leads into the next. We'll get over that one, okay. Blood Eagle, just a little bit ponderous towards the back. That one, he's about 10 or 12 lengths off the leader as they get into the next. And this time it was Catherine the Great that wasn't so great, made the mistake, and has dropped back into third. So, Master of Shadows leads then as they turn towards home again. And Master of Shadows is in the lead by four or five lengths to Bronwyn Killer in second as they get over the seventh. Then after Bronwyn Killen is Catherine the Great with Jane Bird, and then after that, What No Sun, Lintz on the inside of Club Card, who's on the inside of Blood Eagle, who's on the inside of the Grey Ruby Gallop. And my video is a bit juttery, I don't know whether yours is, so hopefully we'll be keeping in sync. And I'm not half a furlong behind everybody else, but it's Master of Shadows who gets over number eight then. And they're all safely over that one and racing away towards the next. Master of Shadows then only leads by two now, Bronwyn Killen. He's stalking that one in second. Then comes Catherine the Great and Jane Burden and then Blood Eagle and what no son of Linton Club Card all together with Ruby Gallup just the back marker as they take the ninth. And all safely over the ninth. With Master of Shadows in the lead. Bronwyn killing second. Catherine the Great now joined by Jane Burden and Blood Eagle as they come down to the fence that will be the last next time round. Safely over that one, all jumping well. Can we see them from the stand? You can see them past the winning post. Now swing left handed now, final circuit of the track. And Master of Shadows continues to lead. From in second place, Bronwyn Killing. And What No Sun has now moved through into third. Catherine a great fourth. Then Blood Eagle. Jane Bird has just dropped back a little bit. Then comes Lintz, who's moved off the fence. Ruby Gallop has gone past Club Card, who is now the new back marker as they race onto the back straight and Master of Shadows he's still three clear Bronwyn Killing is now being joined by What No Son and Catherine the Great and then Lintz and Blood Eagle Ruby Gallop is about to go past Jane Burden that's going to leave Club Card still the back marker as they come down towards the next and the lead for Master of Shadows is now down to no more than a length and a half as they get over the 11th and it's less than a length and now as the field jump that one really nicely and all begin to swamp the leader. But 
Master of Shadows is still just in front. What no son on the outside. Lintz wider still. Then Catherine the Great as they get over the 12th. And now all of a sudden it's What no son who's gone on. What no son's in the lead. Catherine the Great's gone second. Master of Shadows being pushed along. Then Lintz on the outside. They're over the 13th. There's still a fair old way to go. And they're still all in with this. But there's nothing really to rule out yet. Even Club Card at the back's only 10 lengths off the lead. And he's now starting to make some ground around the outside as they swing towards home then. And it's what no sun. Master of Shadows fighting back over the 14th. They go just three more fences to take then now. And it's Master of Shadows in the lead again from Linton. What no sun. Catherine the Great, Blood Eagle, Bronwyn killing. Ruby Gallop is the one who's really running on well then. Club Cart and Jane Burden at the back. They're racing down towards the final three fences then. And Master of Shadows is back in the lead. Lintz is second over a third last. Good jump by Lintz. Sees him jump alongside Master of Shadows. Master of Shadows and Lintz. What no sun in third. Catherine Great is next then Ruby got up and Bronwyn killing they're racing down towards the final two fences then now and Lintz is in the lead by about half a length to Master of Shadows Master of Shadows might have jumped it just about better Catherine the Great's trying to run on again so too is what no son but it's Lintz and Master of Shadows coming down towards the final fence then now and it's Lintz who's got the lead Lintz by three quarters of a length to Master of Shadows in second it's all going to depend on how they jump it it's Lintz who comes in the lead jumps it slowly better jump by Master of Shadows Master of Shadows is trying to get up on the inside. Lintz is holding on on the outside. He's going to be a head bob, but Lintz is stronger. Lintz takes it. Master of Shadows seconds. And then Catherine the Great was third. Then Blood Eagle and Club Card. Jane Burton must have fallen at the last. And it's a win for Darren Thompson. He takes it with Lintz. Now Lintz is the winner for Darren Thompson. Master of Shadows for Josh was on the second. Catherine the Great. For Paul Rhodes was third, Blood Eagle, Leon Redberg was fourth, and What No Son for Craig Beckwith was fifth.